Welcome to Novell, where we are making IT work as one. Today we'd like to introduce you to one of Novell's Quick Fix On Demand training modules. This Quick Fix training discusses advanced Novell eDirectory troubleshooting. Patrick Schneider will do the presentation. Hi, and welcome to this session on Novell eDirectory advanced troubleshooting. My name is Patrick Schneider with Novell Training Services. In this session, we will review the different tools in troubleshooting eDirectory. We will focus on iMonitor. We'll talk about health checks. We'll dive in into some of iMonitor advanced options. We'll talk about uh, troubleshooting obituaries, unknown objects, and schema. And we will review some troubleshooting guidelines. iManager is a web-based administration console that provides secure, customized access to network administration utilities iManager includes all the functionality of its predecessor, Console 1. It is also a single point of administration for Novell eDirectory objects, schema, partitions, and replicas. Novell Remote Manager, also known as Norm, is a web-based utility that you can use to manage your servers from a remote location. You can also use Norm to monitor your server health, change the configuration of your server, or perform diagnostic and debugging tasks iMonitor is a cross-platform tool that allows you to monitor eDirectory across all your servers in your tree. It also provides a web-based alternative for many of the server-specific tools such as DS Browse, DS Trace, DS Diag, and some of the functionality of DS Repair. Some of the other tools you might be familiar with are DS Repair and DS Browse. These tools are generally server-centric, but in this session we will mainly focus on the use of iMonitor. You are watching a small portion of a Novell Quick Fix On Demand training module. The complete module contains all the necessary information that you will need. Let's continue. iMonitor allows you to generate reports to help manage your eDirectory. Some reports can take a long time and can be resource intensive. iMonitor also comes with a list of predefined reports, such as the tree wide server information, obituary listing, object statistics, server advertising, agent health or you can also custom your own report. Let's have a closer look at the tree-wide server information report. By selecting the configure report option, you can see the different options from that report. Here you can select what information you want to show in the report, the type of communication to use, TCP IP or IPX, and you can select to generate a health sub report. This option is not selected by default and is recommended when running your tree-wide server report. Also, you can schedule how often you want to run the report, just run once or schedule it to run uh, daily, weekly, monthly. The information you have just reviewed is just part of the Quick Fix On Demand training module. The complete training module includes all pertinent information, such as tools, files, their locations, as well as troubleshooting tips. Thanks for joining us. For further information on Novell's On Demand training, and how to purchase this and other Novell on-demand training, please click on the URL provided to the right of this video in the description box.